Hi, everybody. Just thought I would come and show y'all what I got going on in here in the greenhouse. Well, actually, this is the in indoor grow. I'm fixing to move this to our old cabinet, I do believe. But they're looking good. Good and healthy. Hope everybody's doing okay today. We um we have been um just enjoying the weather here in the Pacific Northwest. Hey White Tupac, how are you doing, darling? I'm sorry. <laughs> well, I hope everybody's doing okay today. Let's see what we got going on here. Live chat. And oh, I'm really good. I'm just showing off these plants. I got this one here is a um, a Jesus OG. Hang on one second. What the heck is going on? Hi. <laughs> I uh I can't figure out what's going on. There we go. All right. Okay. <laughs> Everybody's doing good today. I just um am having a little technical difficulties right at the moment. But anyway, let me show you what I got going on here in the greenhouse. Uh, well, indoor grow. They are on day 13 in flower, and the cotton tops are just starting to show good. As you can, can see, starting to get the little cotton balls. <laughs> Hi, Iron Fire Horse. How you doing, darling? So good to see you. These two are Jesus OG. I, um, I talked to this one, and kept thimming this one so I'm gonna see which one I like better the thimming or the topping but these are two female no honey I wish it was 13 days from planting the seed 13 days in flower I didn't put that on the the thing I'm sorry if I didn't and sometimes I'm just messed up but I was just gonna show the difference between this is a um, one that has been topped. Hey, Scuba Steve, how are you doing, darling? Great to see you. Ooh, a puff break. Sounds like a winner. But yeah, I um I have um these two Jesus OGs right here. That one I um uh, I topped. Um. There we go. Right there. And this one, I just filmed it. So I'm going to let them go and see which one I like better. If I like the filming or the topping. Right now, it's topping with the two of them. It's looking pretty good. But I don't know. Maybe the size of the nugs on this one may make up for it. We'll just have to wait and see. Now, this, this plant right here, this pretty little plant, this is a whipped cream. Okay, I was, I, I was like, I thought I did, but hey, I am lifted already, so you never know. <laughs> but yeah, this one here is a whipped cream. And uh, they got their their first dose of, uh, of flower nutrients. I mean, second dose, not first. <laughs> they are very, very healthy and happy right now. Hey, Candice. Candy, I, I shortened your name, darling. Instead of Candy Wallace, I made you Candice. How you doing? Hey, Mo Green. Thank you guys for coming. I'm so honored to see y'all. Now, this right here is one of my favorites. It's Albert Walker. I'm just not sure if it's going to be the lemon strain or the other one. They are, are really both really good, but... I like the lemon, lemon a little bit better. Hi, Partly Cloudy 420. So good to see you, darling. 
Thank you all for coming by. Yep. What you doing in the garden, Poppy? Mm. What are you doing? Poppy says, hi, everybody. <laughs> Everything is great right now. I'm, um, this is what I have indoors. I put into flower. And, oh, thank you very much. For the Poppy, get out of there. Hi, Miss Sparks a lot. Thank you for coming by and saying hi. I appreciate it. Hope everybody's doing well. If y'all don't know Mr. Sparks a lot and each other, y'all need to know because there's a bunch of great people in here right now. I can guarantee that. Scuba Steve and Candy and Partly Cloudy and um, Sparks a lot, Iron Fire Horse, Mo Green Stinson. Candy Wallace. Yeah. Great people. Great people. If y'all don't know each other, y'all make sure you do before you leave this chat. Yep, this is um this one here is a uh, Jesus OG. I've got two of those. Hi Flower. How are you doing, darling? I'm just showing off my these are were the baby Jesuses. <laughs> Y'all remember when they, I had them in the greenhouse and I kept calling them the baby Jesuses. So, but this right here is my um, whipping cream. Looking really good and bushy. And of course, the little Albert. I hope everybody's doing good. I, um, Fix and take you outside to the greenhouse. Ooh, who's having fried okra? I love me some fried okra. I had, I made gumbo yesterday. Um, it sure was good. I'm sorry, guys. I'm running outside barefooted, so it's going to take me a second. My tomato plants. I'll show y'all them in a minute. <laughs> All right. Here is uh, the greenhouse. This right here, his first plant, is uh, Crazy Miss Jawa Denny. I just, uh, I filmed it back pretty good. I think I'm going to go ahead and top it, though. But I'm doing a a test to see which, if it's uh, male or female by trying to sex the seeds. I know it's like a 50-50 thing on my end now as far as being able to sex them from, from, from the seeds themselves. But I'm trying to see if I can't get it done, get it figured out. This right here, little bushy thing, is a um, chocolate chunk. One of my one of my favorites that I've grown and that I love. This, I've grown it too. It's crazy train. She's got tons of tops everywhere. Pretty little thing. Hi, ready to hit hot fire. How you doing, darling? Well, it looks like I need to give her a little bit more water before I feed this evening. Pops ain't here right now, but I'll be sure to tell him you came by and said hi, darling. I will be sure to tell him you said hi. Yeah, this is um, this is one of the Albert Walkers. I have two. Um, no, if y'all see, can y'all see that pretty good? I hope so. Um, but she's uh, really good and healthy. Let me show you this stalk. She's gonna be a beast. Gonna be a beast. And I got this is the other Albert. It's a little bit bigger than that one. 
this is the other crazy Miss Jawa Denny that I have. I'm trying to uh, turn it into, uh, trying to turn it into, trying to figure out if it's, that it's a male. It's supposed to be a male. This one is supposed to be the boy. That one, the girl. Let me set them side by side. All right. Now, they're the same age. Seeds from the same place. Um, from uh, Main Girl Genetics. This one here is looking like it's growing a little slower. But she's trying to show out over here. They're looking really good. Now... And this is the, this is my lemon pledge smelling Albert Walker. Ooh, Jamaican land rays, you lucky girl. Oh, sounds nice, partly cloudy. <laughs> OG guap berry, I need me some guap berries. <laughs> they sound delicious. Everybody raves about them, I've heard grow them. I, uh. Yeah, this is the, the Albert Walker that smells like lemon. This It was crossed with either Master Kush or OG Kush. She could not remember which it was. Um, so, anyway, it took after the Kush side. Um, but they, had, uh, they didn't intend to uh, pollinate this plant. They were pollinating the one next to it. And I got like 20 seeds from it. And uh, yeah, been going strong ever since. Of course, the other lemon smelling Albert Walker. This right here is from um, Main Girl. Also, she got a little burn on her. I overdid it feeding her, I guess. I guess. Um, hi, Angel. Welcome, honey. I hope you're doing well today. I'm just showing off the girls. But she's coming out of it really well now. I'm just going to give her a look light, light feeding this time. And just take it easier on her. This right here is another Albert Walker. And I'm not sure. Mmm, yeah, that's lemony. <laughs> I love it. Now, this right here is the plant that was sitting there wouldn't do a darn thing forever and now she's starting to show out so apparently she's she's pretty happy but this is my chocolate chunk my chocolate chunk and my albert walker are my favorites oh uh, what the heck it's got can y'all see that it's growing down i guess it'll turn back up that's kind of weird. The whole top is coming out from there. Is that odd or normal? I don't even know. There we go. Can you see it? Oh, chocolate chunk is some amazing smoke. I love it. It is a great medicine. Great medicine. I'll tell you what. Anything that's uh, that's bothering you, you're going to get two flower in a couple of days, hopefully. Well, no, it won't be a couple of days. It'll be after you get her done. But yes, 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 I want you to try some too. But and that's what I got going on out in the grow house. I hadn't shown anybody anything in a minute. And I thought, well, I would just, uh, we still have our... Our little 45 watt grow lights out here because some days it's just so cloudy that they need a little bit of boost. I'm fixing to come in and clean this joker right here up, get her lollipopped and ready to go. I've, uh, I'm on the first of August. Well, not this, not this feeding, but the next feeding, which will be a couple days after, I guess. Um, then I'm going to start with the flowering nutrients on these girls. Oh, you haven't tried it yet? Oh, my goodness. It is amazing medicine, partly cloudy. It, I wish I could, it's so good, I can't even describe it. It's got like a coffee smell and like, um, 
it's funk. <laughs> it's not not a diesel smell. Not. Um, it's more like mm, concentrated flowers and stuff. It's just beautiful stuff. Just all there is to it. It's just amazing. I love it. Now this this one will be going in in a in a few days. But I see um, just before I turned the started doing my thing, I saw a little bit of thrips, little bit of thrips. So I might have to get out here and spray today. Might as well spray the girls inside too, because as you know, when they were out here. So let me see. Oh, yes, it is tolerant resistance. I have been smoking this stuff uh, on the chocolate chunk for months, and I do not get to where I'm like, oh, I'm not high anymore because I stay high off of it. We made some wax out of it. It was amazing. Yes, I'm, I'm telling you, if you get a chance, buy some chocolate chunk and try it. I'm telling mine. This one is so so potent, though. I don't even know what. Um, I wish I could test it to find out how strong it is because it's just that potent. The Albert is good, and in the beginning, it's good and it stays good for a while. But then it it doesn't take long until you're you're not uh, getting buzzed. This one here's a chocolate chunk too. It's they're doing good. Everybody's happy. They, it's time to feed again. I'm going to just give her a light feeding this time because I've just been watering her down and trying to flush my hurt out of her. <laughs> I sure didn't mean to hurt her, but it happens. I think what I did there is I watered her twice. And so I think that's what happened is why she got burned up so but she's still doing well i mean she's she's putting out new growth down here and there's still a lot of greenery down in here i need to take and pull her open some more and get her look at all these all these tops tons Okay, everybody, let me know what y'all are smoking on. What I need to try. Y'all need to try y'all some chocolate chunk, I guarantee you. This crazy train is, is good, too. It, when it's growing, it reminds me of cat piss. Got my basil making seeds. Ooh. Iron Fire Horse smoking diesel. Sparks a lot is smoking cookies, cookie berries. Oh, Steve, purple punch flower. I've got some seeds that are mixed with purple punch. Um, oh, the wax. We we took um let me let me think. We took 19 grams of sugar leaf with no buds and we got back like five five grams all together I think Girl Scout cookies oh yeah boarhead sounds good <laughs> yep yeah. these are my these are my girls I've got uh, a space for a couple more. I've got my deck is all messed up because I'm having issues right now, and they're coming out to to um. We have septic. I mean, uh, yeah, septic here in Washington State, so they got to come out and fix the septic, and and that's always lovely. So that's what I'm dealing with right now. But these are my tomatoes that I'm growing. These are our cherry globe tomatoes. These are so sweet. They're some of the best. What are you doing, Poppy? Are you sun worshiping? Are you a sun worshiper? Oh, no, not in public. You don't lick your butt in public. 
<laughs> oh yeah and this was a um a yellow gold but i think it, they cr had to cross with aroma let me show you these little tomatoes here they're quite unique And they're orange. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Sparks. I appreciate you coming by. Always, always lovely to see you. And I hope you have a, a great rest of your day. And everybody, um, if you don't know Mr. Sparks Light, you're missing out. He's a wonderful guy. And he is... Um, very knowledgeable and somebody that uh likes to share his knowledge and that's wonderful i appreciate that yeah that's what i thought too scuba is because this one here these little tomatoes that stayed round they have a thinner skin and the other one is a lot thicker and so i'm thinking that that it crossed with that roma and it's a little meatier tomato Yes, and there's some more kicking it. <laughs> but I love maters too. These right here are bishop, uh, bishop cap peppers, hot peppers. Yeah, I love growing all kinds of stuff, Angel. I just, just love it. I got my lavender up there kicking it. My roses done, they done done their thing. They're saying, uh, just growing rose hips right now. Yeah, aren't they amazing looking peppers? I love the, the look of them. Oh, get off there. Little gnat, got to spray you too. <laughs> I got Brussels sprouts over in the other garden, but my collards are not doing well I'm fixing to dig all them up and got a little airplane plant in there so I'm gonna smoke a bowl <laughs> oh, I'm trying to go up on my deck and I have half a deck my um, son made it flower. He's here now. Not feeling too good. I know bad bug season for sure. I uh, have been dealing with um, thrips real bad. And they apparently like collards too. So uh, <laughs> so well I got some of this uh, this chocolate chunk let me show you what it looks like hmm if I can find it oh yeah Sure. I think we done picked out all the good <laughs> not all of them they're all good but and yeah focus well it ain't gonna do it I can have it. Hmm. I wonder if maybe if I uh well trying to focus, but you can't see it. Mm, well, that ain't gonna help. All right. But anyway, it's some really good stuff. <laughs> mm. 
and it it's got ever so slight hint of um, hint of pine and coffee, like I said. Um, and when you smoke it and you go to exhale, it's like flowers. Delicious. Absolutely wonderful. I just love it. All right. Well, I am not well prepared for this. So, I'm going to put y'all right, right there. <laughs> Cheers, guys. was good hmm. <coughs> oh take it out maybe if I take it outside I can show you <coughs> oh you know what I've never had homemade ketchup I wonder I mean, I wonder, I bet it's good. <laughs> Let's see here. I can get this in some real light. Can you see it? I can't see it real well. Oh, it went, hi, love bug. I will talk to you in a little bit, okay? I will call you special and talk to you. Since you're, I bet you're trying to talk to me. <laughs> All right, guys. That's the best it's going to do. Did y'all get a good, good look at it? I really couldn't tell. <laughs> oh, nice, nice. Mm. Hi, Mojo Grow. How are you doing, honey? Thank you for coming by. I appreciate that. I uh, haven't been live in a minute, and I've been missing everybody and wanting to catch up. I hope everybody's doing great. I, uh, yeah, I need to redo my hair, I think. <laughs> just about that time I've got the box in there I'm just waiting on the the right opportunity um if y'all don't know mojo grow y'all need to go by and check them out um of course they're a grower and um they're um kind of new to me they may have known me for a while but I'm new to their page and and yeah they're they're growing over there and it looks good real good so I appreciate everybody coming by and hanging out with me today. Y'all are so sweet. I've got so much work to do. Like I said, my son and his girl are here, and I've got another son and his wife staying with us till the weekend. So we got a house full. Oh, you're welcome, Mojo. And y'all just have a have a great blessed weekend. Week, not weekend. <laughs> just got over the weekend. Y'all have a great blessed week, and try to be kind to each other. And remember, if somebody says something snappy to you, maybe maybe they just had a bad day and need a little understanding. All right, guys. Y'all have a good one.